Schöne. Ziek voor het eerst wat ruimte en het gezicht naar het doel. Ziek drukt af. Geen problemen voor Pavlenka. Nieuwe nummer 10. Van twee. Wat dat betreft een luxe probleem voor Keizer. Die ook nog Karel Eiting als talentvolle middenvelder tot zijn beschikking heeft. Terwijl Werder bouwt aan een nieuwe aanval. En daar ruimte is bij Augum Stinson. Die kan afdrukken. En Alvans heeft hem. Prima gekiept. Nog veel ruimte weer voor die uh, nummer 5 er aan de linkerkant. De meest lastige speler in de openingsfase voor Ajax. Over de jaren te worden gezegd. Sommige van de grootste die we hebben genoemd. Johan Cruijff, Nijskins, Rudy Kroll van de 60s en 70s. De laatste generatie Van Basten, Rijkaard, Bergkamp, de De Berteren, Seedorf, Davids, Kluivert en Schneider. De list gaat gewoon aan. En nu hebben we een kans voor Ajax om een schoenige opportunity te krijgen. Cassieta does get the shot in, and it's the first goal of the game. That flew in left footed from Cassieta. Matteo Cassieta, the Colombian, signed from Deportivo Cali this time last year. He's only 20 years of age, but as we await the replay, finds some space, right footed, swings it round the goalkeeper Pavlenka from this angle. It's hard to see, but uh, it's very good shot he curved it in just inside the far post so very much against the run of play really where Herta Bremen have been putting Ajax under a lot of pressure and have put a lot of chance for a shot here left footed shot that only sailed a couple of feet wide of the goalkeeper's left hand post uh, Hakim Ziyech didn't need a second invitation there's the ball dropped kindly for him just looked up took aim and I think it would have beaten the goal I think he took the wrong option there. He tried to go outside the player on his right foot. It was on his left. If he got the shot away on his left foot first time, as Clivert breaks down the right hand side, he's got a one on one with Moisander. A couple of step overs, left foot, center right foot. Excellent shot, just about a yard too high. But uh, hardly any backlift there from Justin Clivert. And uh, he certainly sold uh, Moisander a dummy there and got the shot in very impressively. But just from that range, just couldn't keep it down enough got across two-handed right in the top corner to block the shot it was a snapshot of that I don't think the goalkeeper was uh, expecting that but a very good save to make up for his effort for seven years he was an Ajax player previously from 2006 to 2009 he's also played for PSV AC Milan and Real Madrid all have been oh, European oh, Cup or Champions League champions and it's the first chance for her to bring a snapshot it's the equalizer Excellent work from Johannes Segerstein. It's probably his first touch of the ball in, since he came on at half-time. The young 19-year-old ge German. He's been at Werder Bremen for four years now as we wait the replay. To go with his left foot, curled it away from the goalkeeper, low to the goalkeeper's left, just inside the left-hand post. Excellent finish from Johannes Segerstein. So we have a game on. Ball forward. Oh, no. That angle is hard to see, so it's picking the ball up about 18 yards out, hits it left foot. Referee's giving the free kick though. Zetra way outside his goal. Trying to get it behind the defence. Could have a penalty. That was a totally unnecessary penalty there. As the ball's running out of play and two players are challenging for it. A little drag back there from. I think it might be Dan Kalui. Dan Kalui just pulls back the shirt of Thomas Delaney. Thomas Delaney made a good run, as you can see. A little pull back by the left hand of Damiel Dan Kalui. And he's given a penalty away. An opportunity for Werder Bremen to take the lead in the 62nd minute. Very firm penalty down to the goalkeeper's right-hand side, Florian Kynes. Hits it uh, just about a foot inside the post. Very well-taken penalty. 
Norbert Abbas read that very well, got down as quickly as he could, but without really cheating and coming off his line to prevent the angle, that was a very well taken penalty. So, Werder Bremen come from behind. They're now leading 2 1. A lot of Werder Bremen supporters in the crowd here, they're very happy with that, but that was a very soft penalty to give away. <laughs> Ball had to be played late there because uh, Mane had run too early to get goal side for, and would have clearly been flagged for offside if he'd been, the ball had been passed to him. Dan Kalui got some making up to do for giving away the penalty and almost a great ball through that time. Chance here for Ajax through Antler. Oh, a great chip. Goalkeeper just got his fingertips to it and onto the crossbar. But that was some good work from, from Ajax there. And once again, Klaus Jan Huntelay just looked up from about 15 yards, a really deft chip with his right foot, it's like using a sandwich. But um, some very sharp goalkeeping by Michael Zetra as we see a replay, it just gets the tip of his fingers to it, just enough to...